All right, welcome to this tutorial. And in this tutorial, I'm going to be doing some really fun, simple, uh, beginner friendly uh, art. And we're going to do a lot of like nice scene, a lot of mountain. We will do some sun, uh, blower effect adjustment. So perfect for beginner. If you are a beginner, this could be a really great exercise to, you know, try out some techniques and practice procreate. So first create the screen size canvas. Go right here and the first thing I'll do is I'll clear some of this palette and I have a donut palette from my previous artwork but I don't I don't want any of that so let's just set that to default so modern pop and first thing I'll do is I'll create go to a little yellow color and uh, this one will be a sun, so I want to do a yellow and make sure on the brush I go to calligraphy and monoline. That's the brush I'm going to be using uh, throughout this tutorial. So click on that, uh, get a yellow color. The color code, by the way, will be down on the description. So you can like paste it, we go out to the color and then go to value and you can, like paste it here to bring in that color. But yeah. You can also use the disc and estimate the color. So yellow color, monoline brush uh, on the first layer. I'll create a circle. One tap, a little bit bigger. And yeah, that's great. Drop the color in. And uh, one tap usually makes the circle perfect. So uh, that's why I use the one tap. and. Once you have that down, I'll go duplicate this layer. On the new layer, I'll darken the color a little bit. So orange, reddish orange. Um, let's drop that in. And after doing that, I'll bring that below. So the yellow on, stays on the top and the orange one stays at the bottom. Then what I do is click on the orange one, go to adjustment and Gaussian blur. So layer, um, I'll blur that a little bit and then you can see that it's like the sun is shining almost so pretty cool that's 100 percent uh, we want to do a little bit of blur not too much so and that's uh that's pretty good right there i think 19 percent 20 percent is good so i'll leave that off that look good uh, i'll do another layer and bring that on the top and this layer, we're going to do some mountain. So I'll start with some bright uh, blue, a, light, a little lighter blue. So just look good. One line brush. And then I'll draw my first mountain. You can draw it any way you like. I'll cut off the sun a little bit for the design purpose. And then I'll close it up, drop the color in. Then Go for another layer, darken this color a little bit. Mm. Yep, a little bit dark. So I move this down a little bit, move that down a little bit. And then I'll do another mountain. There we go. Close that up and drop that in. And okay. Fix that line on the mountain a little bit. So there you have it. There we go. So that's one. And then I'll do is I'll create another layer, darken it up a little bit. There we go. That's look nice. And then this will be my final mountain. So I'll just bring it in here i got the third mountain close that off as well drop that in so the mountain is like lighter mountain stay at farther away uh, darker mountains stay close to us so that how the light kind of work and yeah this look pretty good i think and then i'll go to the background change it to a little dark blue this look good and 
to like reflect a little bit on the dark like sun is almost setting uh, the sky is dark uh, that kind of look and once we have that down I'll go to add a layer uh, this one I'll create a white color monoline and I'll just do some drops or the stars bring the opacity up a little bit bring the size up a little bit opacity down size a little down like play around with that sidebar a little bit opacity up That's great. And then we can create like a big star around here somewhere. Here. Opacity down a little bit on that one. A big star. Yes. So yeah, we have some stars and next I will do is I'll duplicate this layer and same thing adjustment Gaussian blur on that layer. So you can see like there's a difference on the blur the stars kind of like glows and it's become too much blur. So we want to have like a glow effect. There we go. And that's it. That's the painting. We use a lot of layer mask. Uh, we use some adjustment. Uh, so I think this is uh, a very nice exercise for beginners to try out and have a practice at it. If you like this, make sure you like the video, comment down below and make sure you subscribe. I just started this channel and uh, I hope it helps some of you learn procreate and have a good practice when it comes to you know watching tutorials and uh, painting as you go so make sure you subscribe uh, recommend share with a friend and i hope to see you on the next video thank you